you're literally you're the idea for you to make thirty two fifty and little small token like small token income or you know income um, affiliate deals are good and they're necessary and I live you know I live a good portion of my income is from small fourteen ninety fives and you get your seven bucks and they like an ILN or whatever twenty five bucks a month or whatever you're in those things are good but do you have something like that where it's not going to take a hundred new buyers to create that for you and so this is one of those things where if you're gonna you know, inside GRN there's three levels right and I don't even want to talk about the first one so I'm only going to talk about the last two twelve thousand five hundred dollars is our top level gives you 20 weeks of usage it's a la carte you usually pay between 399 and 799 for the week and that's pretty much it there's no real strings attached there's there's availability all over the world we have over 5,000 resorts it's it's just an awesome package Super awesome pack. That's our top one. That pays seven thousand seven hundred dollars. You know, one of those. You know, and here's the thing: people will spend twenty four. They'll get a loan for twenty four. You know, thirty thousand dollars for a car. And this is this is just super. This is just to be an asset test. And we weren't taught this stuff. You know what I mean? So it's not a big deal. But people will will get a loan for twenty four thousand for thirty thousand. They'll get a new car and they'll parade that thing around, show aunt and uncle and family and friends and, you know, oh, it's just everyone's just cheery, cheery, you know, great for you. You got a new car. And I, I have the brand new Cadillac, a brand new, the $92,000 Escalade. I'm all about nice cars. I'm all about them. I couldn't be about them anymore. So I'm all about a happy, like I get the feeling of how awesome a new car is. It's, it's fun. But there's people that will go do this. And they'll get their car and they'll just be gleeful as all puppies. And then they look at something like this, they can open up a whole new lifestyle of travel and memories and adventure and then position them to make seven thousand seven hundred dollars like a field over and 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 over. And it can become like an oil well to them, that it can be the driving force of how they get good at video, of how they get good at ads, of how they get good at everything. This thing can act like a carrot, this commission can act like a carrot that can move them to throw out their VIP days, to really pour it on, to develop the skill sets, to deserve a sale where someone will pay twelve five for a product that they don't even have to service or create on the best real estate in the world, billions of dollars of resort infrastructure all over the planet. And then they can add a VIP day to it, make a single sale, and it can change their life in a radical way. It costs 12500 But that same person is sitting here sweating blood drops, sweating blood drops saying no, 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 not even thinking, not even opening the creative structures of their mind to come up with a way for them to move into their dreams. But a $30,000 car loan, for days. They'll do it for days. Brand new TV that costs two grand, for days. Right? It just, it's not that it doesn't make any sense, it's that it's incongruent if they want to be an entrepreneur. Raise your hand if that makes sense. I'm not judging people that have new cars and not businesses, but if you want to have a new business and you want to play in this league and you're pussyfoot and wussy and around, scared to, to really dive in and really go for it, just don't go for it at all. It's not a big deal. Or play around in the shallows, but just realize that you're playing around in the shallows. So if this is the ocean and you know the shore goes like this and the whales are out here, you know, millions of dollars sit out here. And you're you're sitting around on only, you know, token incomes. It's okay. Right? It's okay. There's nothing morally wrong. But just realize you're just kind of splashing around with the kids. You're not actually, you know, buying the boat and heading out to sea and getting good at swimming in the deep waters. And this is where a lot of the adventures, I'm not saying this isn't fun and satisfying, it is, but this is where you can do some some real legacy changing stuff. So raise your hand if you're getting some value tonight. I think this is good. I think people deserve to hear this. They should hear this. They need to hear this almost. But number one is just simple positioning to make money, right? So the two, like I said, the top two levels with GRN, twelve thousand five hundred, and it pays you seven seventy. And literally, you can you can save this money back on probably three trips. Now, the most popular level is five k. It gives you 10 weeks of usage per year. The weeks cost between $399 and $799. 5K it pays you $3250. That's so sweet. And there's no there's no requirements that you sell one a month or that you it's it. It's just a really sweet, clean, your very first sale right out of the gate, $3250. 
what I would do if I were you, I would get into this thing. I would start playing. When I got, as soon as I got GRN, I would be back looking at their vacation offerings all the time. Couldn't really afford to go on any of the trips, even though they were four hundred dollars. I did go to Hawaii right away just to use the membership, but I just kept looking and I kept familiarizing myself. And I imagined myself in Cabo, and I, you know, I was just there. And I imagined myself in Puerto Vallarta, swimming with the dolphins with my son, and I was there. And I imagined being in Hawaii with my wife, romancing on all these sexy little hidden miracle tropical paths. And I've been there. And I imagined doing bromance trips to Hawaii with just my friends, never mind my wife or kids and my bromance. And I've been there. And I imagined all of these things. And GRN has allowed them to happen. And not only the travel membership has allowed them to happen, but the lifestyle and the, and the whale type money, you know, the bigger money and the deeper, deeper waters has been there. So it's a powerful thing. So number one, I would position yourself to actually make money. And I would do whatever it took. I would pull out of my IRA if I were you. If you're if you're into this, if you're not into this, you know, don't take my advice on this one. I would apply for extra credit cards, I would get a high interest loan. I would do whatever. I would cash out my 401k. I would, I would do whatever it took to move into the heart of what I wanted in life because it's short, at, even at the longest. And I would, I would research into the heart and I'd say, what do I want? If I want travel, and I want you know new, new friend set, right? And I want you know more time freedom. And I really like the internet marketing thing. And this is what's in my heart, right? I, I have this stuff in my heart, but then if the stop is like, oh, I'm scared, okay? Well, that'd be okay if like no one else was doing this, but if we didn't have like thousands and thousands of people doing this, you know, your fear there is is your own upbringing, it's your own insecurities, it's, it's I'm not invalidating it, I'm just putting it in its perspective. So if you have your heart palpitating for all this stuff, but you have the fear of, you know, what if I fail, or you have the, fear of, you know, what's my family going to think of me and your family, you know, families are meant to be a, a catalyst. They're meant to be a trampoline. A lot of times they're an anchor, they're a plow and you've got to unhitch from the family legacy that you're in. You have to unhitch. doesn't mean you unhitch from your family. It means you unhitch from the psychic baggage that you grew up with and you say, I'm going to just roll and, and I'm going to run and live based on my heart instead of based on my family. Now my family's in my heart. But they're not going to run the show anymore. What I feel I'm being called to and what I want is heavier than my uncle's judgment on what I'm doing. Raise your hand if that makes sense. It's amazing. I mean, this fear thing is huge. Some of you are seriously more concerned at what your friend's dad is going to say about what you're doing than you are concerned about having, doing, and becoming everything you ever wanted to have, do, and become. And you're letting other people's small mindedness other people's perceptions, other people's judgments, other people's mocking and laughter, that has deeper gravity than everything that you want. It's madness. Don't fall for it. So this stuff, <laughs> this stuff is, my phone's blowing up now. Am I, is this good? I'm on fire today. I didn't even mean this. Um, so if fear is over here, if fear of the family, you know, and if, if some kind of like, you're, you're locking your mind you're locking out possibility to gen to create the wealth to purchase, right? You're basically because instead of saying like you know you're it's not in the budget. Well, what's in the budget? I mean, the budget. Nobody, come on, budget. You're locking like if you say this isn't possible, your you know your frame of mind is that things aren't possible. If you open up for what's possible, you'd find that you know what that. That signed football that's worth a thousand dollars, whatever we can sell that. We can eBay this stuff. We can sell the old motorcycle, the old guitar. We can pull out the IRA. We can open up a couple of different credit cards. We can max out a credit card or two. We can do what we want, and and the heart and the calling of the heart is worth going for. Now, as long as you realize that after you go into your heart, there's this little thing called work, and then you put your hand to the plow. And then you type the emails, you record the things, you attend the webinars, you create the webinars, you hustle, you type the emails, you read the books, you get it, you give it all your heart. Once you let your heart inform you, you then give your effort all your heart to. So raise your hand if you get that it's the dual heart thing. It's let listen to your heart, and then once you listen to it, make sure you give everything you got with your heart. So don't let your heart trick you. Okay, and don't let your lazy habits destroy you here. Because that's what happens way too often. 
So don't let don't let that happen. All right, I'm getting out of here. Here's what I would recommend you to do: get back to the person that invited you here. Get back. Tell them you attended at the very least. Send them a Facebook message. Send them a text. Say, hey, I was on this uh, lifestyle webinar with Hoverson, looking at GRN. Ask a couple questions. Ask the game plan. I only told you number one, and you know what? Who cares after number one? Position yourself. Once you position yourself, you have that 3250 commission in front of you. You have those vacation offerings in front of you. Put a carrot in front of your life that gets you out of bed. You know, the deeper field and stuff like that. It's like put something in front of you that is inspiring to move forward, right? So you got your carrot. No, what, what is that? I'm so bad at this. You've got your, a lot of you are here and you feel stuck, you feel bored, you feel stagnant. Put a big enough carrot in front of you where it's like, you know what? Your heart kind of throbs for that and you're going for it. That's worth it. And along the way, you're going to pick up all sorts of interesting characters and friends. You're going to pick up all sorts of characters and, and uh, attitudes. You're going to pick up some new books. You're going to have some new adventures as you attend conferences and network all over the world. You're going to have new friends. I mean, it's, it's an adventure, so the carrot isn't even the point. The pursuit of the carrot, and then you get all these little, you know, your muscles get bigger, you get more in shape, everything is better. <laughs> get back to the person that brought you here. Let's have a smoking awesome weekend. I love you guys. I love your patronage. I love your support. I love your patience with us as we develop all the business structures that we do. Um, you guys are amazing. You make my life go round, and I think of you often. All right. Get back.